In this video, we're going to describe the purpose of MIDI and the use of event messages in MIDI. And we're going to describe the advantages of using MIDI for representing music. So what exactly is MIDI? Well, it's a technical standard which was established and has now been widely adopted. The standard describes a protocol, a digital interface, and also a standard set of connectors. This standard, once widely adopted, allows for a wide range of electronic musical instruments and computers to communicate with each other. They do this by using a MIDI controller, which sends and receives what are known as event messages to any device connected. The messages specify all sorts of details, such as how long the note should be, its pitch, its volume change, vibrato. It also helps to synchronise tempo, along with many other things. Now, just be careful here, you don't make a snake in the exam. A MIDI file is definitely not the same thing as a digital recording of a live audio source. In essence, a MIDI file, if you actually looked at its contents, is nothing more than a list of instructions. And these instructions detail how to synthesize a sound by providing the information on the pitch, the length, the type of instrument, etc, etc. These sounds being tiny pre-recorded digital samples of real instruments. Now the huge advantage of using MIDI is the resultant MIDI file uses far far less disk space than a traditional digital recording, up to a thousand times less. It also becomes very easy to manipulate individual instruments. And one MIDI artist in a studio can now take the place of a whole ensemble of performers.